The Force is with you, young Skywalker. But you are not a Jedi yet. Hey, what is up, everybody? It's Dupree, aka Darth Harry, here with some brand new, fresh Star Wars news for you. But before we get into it, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe, and also check out my last video because that greatly helps out the channel. So let's get into it. The High Republic era of Star Wars is one that hasn't been explored on the big screen or small screen yet, taking place more than a century before the events of the Skywalker saga. Currently, the story is being told through a series of novels and comic books, although it's finally set to take place in a live action story thanks to the Acolyte's debut on Disney Plus sometime in 2024. The High Republic adventures are set to continue on with Phase 3 of the initiative coming in late of 2023, with more details likely to be revealed that next chapter at Star Wars Celebration in a later few months. But now fans will get a look at this era even earlier thanks to a newest piece of programming coming to younger viewers on Disney+. Star Wars shared our official look at the first Star Wars High Republic Disney Plus show, the animated Star Wars Young Jedi Adventures. Master Yoda stands with a quartet of Jedi younglings as they learn the ways of the Force with a shot also including a tiny droid on the far right side. Three of these Jedi wield lightsabers as they smile at one another, two of them holding blue blades while one holds a purple blade. This also came with an official press release announced with the series premiering on Disney Plus and Disney Junior on May 4th celebrating Star Wars Day with this new children's adventure. Set during the High Republic era, the animated series follows Jedi younglings as they study the ways of the Force, explore the galaxy, help citizens and creatures in need, and learn valuable skills needed to become Jedi along the way. The characters seen in the photos are Jedi younglings Kai, Liz, and Nubs, along with their friends Nash and RJ83 as they train on the planet Tenno. Alyssa Sapphire, Senior Vice President Development Series and Strategy for Disney Junior celebrated the network's collaboration with Lucasfilm, describing it as a way to introduce Star Wars to a younger generation of fans. Our color, she went on to say, our collaboration with Lucasfilm on this series is an amazing opportunity to introduce this universally cherished franchise to a younger generation. As an early entry point into Star Wars, we have created a series with exciting new and familiar characters and storylines that highlight the values of compassion, teamwork, and friendship, which are important elements for all of our Disney Junior programming. The press release also lists six actors that will voice characters in the series, including Star Wars animation mainstay D. Bradley Baker as Nubs. While fans are still waiting to see the High Republic era take shape in live action, this new animated series should offer a nice tease into what to expect when it does eventually come to the big screen. Seeing Jedi Younglings train with the iconic Master Jedi Yoda will bring back memories of the Skywalker saga stories from past, particularly with Jedi having mostly been out of the picture since Star Wars began its run in Disney Plus over three years ago. After seeing this group of up and coming Jedi come into their own and a story that will be easily to digest for fans of all ages, the High Republic will continue to expand from there into new live action Disney Plus shows over the coming years. So what do I think about this? This is great. This is obviously catered to a younger audience and like they said, this is a nice entry point for new fans or younger fans kids mind you to get into Star Wars. Everybody always has their entry point. Mine was the original trilogy and before then we didn't really have a lot of stories centered around young kids or four kids in Star Wars. So this is a nice entry point. From the picture right here you got the three Jedi. You got I can't even tell what the characters are. Okay so I guess you got the one human and then I guess this is Nubs. This little fuzzy blue eared thing with the lightsaber i guess kai no or Liz. i can't even tell what species she is but you know it doesn't really matter and then the other photo i have right here is all of them with this little droid standing off to the far right which looks kind of cute very bb8 like very cutesy and then the main photo obviously is yoda right here i'm obviously going to be watching the show because i'm assuming this is going to be canon and this obviously takes place in the high republic and lucasfilm is pushing a high republic with great interest which is interesting because you know all of us fans want old republic and nice old republic stuff and this new you know initiative with the high republic means 
a lot of big things are coming and a lot of tie-ins. So anyway, uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below about this series. Will you be watching it? Will you just let it go and let it just be the kid show that it is? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And as always, if you like this video, please hit that like button. If you're not subscribed to your channel, hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that bell to get notifications for all my latest videos. That would be great. Anyway, guys, take care. See you in the next one. May the force be with you. Bye.